Yeah, long run aggregate supply is what we're going to talk about next. And this is a graph of our long run aggregate supply, and it's just a straight line. And this y star is our equilibrium, uh, equilibrium income or output. And I just want to make note that this long run aggregate supply uh, line or curve or whatever you want to call it is unaffected. It's unaffected unaffected by prices by prices because uh, but because by now because by now prices by now prices have already adjusted have adjusted so in the long run this uh, long run aggregate supply curve is unaffected by prices because prices have adjusted. And a little bit about the change in long run aggregate supply. If the factor supply rises, then the LRAS, the long run aggregate supply, moves right. Moves right. But, and if uh, productivity or technology increases rises or rises then the LR, LRAS also moves right again so if any of these two uh, things happen or the opposite of these two happens then uh, the LRAS will move left left is uh, will move right or left uh, depending on what uh, what changes uh, occurred and on to long run equilibrium. So in long run equilibrium, you can see here that I already drew the graph here for you because I draw graphs kind of slow and I don't want to waste your time. So one point I want to make, just one point, and you probably already see it already, is that the aggregate demand is equal to the aggregate supply, and that is equal to the long run aggregate supply. And that's the only point I want to make. And we can also see that we have the equilibrium price and equilibrium output, but that's not really important at the moment. And lastly is price flexibility. I'm going to try to make this video super short. So price flexibility. Um, the main thing you got to know is that price rises quickly but falls slowly. And price flexibility is just that. It causes uh, rising prices fast, but sticky falling prices so uh let's say that causes uh fast rising prices or are rising prices also fast rising prices uh but sticky now that means it's slow right so it's sticky uh, falling prices and some reasons of why the prices uh, rise quickly is because of uh, contracts because of contracts or unions or unions and some reasons why it falls slowly is because of uh, one main reason is because of pride because the slang way of writing it because of pride and yeah uh, nobody wants to work for a lower wage so probably we don't wanna work for lower wage because of pride that is why the prices uh, fall slowly. That is why we have sticky prices. And that is all I want to go through in this video.